Hiya! It's Heidi the Slap Addict, also known as the Confidence Guru. Um, a few people have been asking me if I'd do a quick demonstration of emotional freedom technique and how to use it. So I've just made this quick video, um, which I hope you find helpful. So uh, yeah, let me just talk you through quickly what EFT is. So EFT is um, what's also known as tapping. So what you're doing is you're tapping onto uh, the meridian and acupuncture points or acupressure points on your body. Um, different people do believe different things about why it works. Um, some people think that it opens your chakras. Some people think that it opens your chi or energy lines. Some people think it's just actually the ritual of doing it that embeds the, the behaviours and the new, the new affirmations that you're embedding. Whatever the reason for why it works, it has worked for me. So um, I kind of don't get too bogged down with why it works. I just know that it does and it has for me particularly what I've used it for is for panic attacks so I used to suffer with really terrible panic attacks and I used EFT and affirmations to basically rid myself of them and to bring myself back from that panicky feeling I've got a turban on because I've got a show tonight so I hope you'll excuse me uh, so yeah so um I just wanted to show you how I do them how, how what I do so it's important for me that the affirmation is right as well so the affirmation that I use when I'm dealing with things that are emotional particularly or feeling based I use the process of, even though I'm feeling however it is that I'm feeling, I greatly love and accept myself. That's always the same. I choose to feel how I'm going to choose, the new way I'm going to choose, even though I'm feeling however it is I'm feeling. So what that's doing is it's acknowledging your feeling. It's acknowledging where you're coming from, but it's also um, kind of programming in a new feeling, a new emotional response. Um, so I'll show you where the, uh, where the tapping points are and um, I'll talk you through it. So your first one is, now you can't see because I've got a turban and an owl on my head, but your first tapping point is if you had a centre parting, it's either side of your centre parting and you want to be tapping with your fingers, the tips of your fingers, at about this speed. You're tapping enough to feel it, but not so much that it hurts. Okay, so your first tapping point is here and you're going to do three rounds of the affirmation on each tapping point. So you're doing it here and out loud you're going to say your affirmation. So mine is, even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. It's the first tapping point. Your next tapping point is here on your brow bone, and I do it with two fingers, and I do it on both sides. Same again whatever your affirmation might be. So for me, it's for my panic attacks, it was even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Three sets. Second set is here on the fleshy part of your, between your eye and your cheekbone. And again, it's right on here on the fleshy bit. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. The next one is here on your collarbone, right here on the, on the sticky out bit of your collarbone. Three sets. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Right, your next one can be a bit harder, particularly if you're like me, you've got big boobs. But basically you're hugging yourself and you're doing the little fleshy bit of your back here, just where your bra strap is. And you're tapping. If you can only do one side, just do one side. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Next one is here on your Cupid's bow. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. 
I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Then move on to here, where your little must your little beard would be. <laughs> even though I'm feeling panicked, into that dent there. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Two more. Next one is here, just on one hand. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. And your final one is on your wrists here. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Even though I'm feeling panicked, I greatly love and accept myself. I choose to feel calm and relaxed, even though I'm feeling panicked. Big deep breath in. Exhale. What I found was if I did a full round of them when I was feeling panicky, by the time I got to the end of the round, it was done. I was not panicky anymore. I felt more connected, felt more calm and relaxed. Once you've done it a few times, you can use it just here, just here, but do the full round to start off with. I hope that's helpful. See you later.